A very good morning to all, and thank you for joining the Prelude, today's orientation program on the virtual platform. I, Jeanal Chaudhary, take this opportunity to welcome you all on behalf of Gitaratan International Business School in this orientation program. Vakratun Mahakai, Surakoti Samaprabha, Nirvignam Kurumadev, Sarvakarishu Sarvada. Before starting the event, we shall pray to Lord Ganesha to make this event successful and, and bless us with his gracious glory. What a mesmerizing performance it was. It truly is the purpose of this event. Gita Ratan International Business School was established in the year 2004. Gibbs is affiliated to Guru Gobind Singh Indraprastha University, Delhi. The institute is conducting programs like MBA, MBA International Business, BBA General, BA LLB, BBA LLB. 
Gibbs is NAC A accredited institute and has also been rated grade A by academic audit cell of Guru Gobind Singh Indraprastha University consistently from last five years. Gibbs has been rated as A plus by State Fee Regulatory Committee by Government of NCT of Delhi. And it has been awarded highest grading A by Joint Inspe Inspection Committee of Government of Delhi and GGSIPU. Gibbs has been rated number two by Times B School Survey for the last two years, 2018 and 2019. Now, I would like to invite respected director, sir, Professor Dr. B.S. Hothi to welcome the students. Good morning, everyone present here. Honor our Honorable Chairman, Shri Arun Jindal, our Honorable Vice Chairman, Shri Anrud Jindal, respected Professor Sanjeev Mittal, Director of Academic Affairs, Guru Gobind Singh, Indraprastha University, New Delhi. Faculty members, parents, students of the fresh batch of BBA. I welcome fresh batch of BBA to Geeta Ratan International Business School. I also welcome Professor Sanjeev Mittal. His words of wisdom are going to motivate the students of BBA fresh batch. Dear students, this orientation program will make you familiar with different academic and administrative processes and different activities like extracurricular, curricular activities being organized by the Institute. In your three years journey at Gita Ratan International Business School, you will become familiar, you will be made familiar with the concepts of management theories and its application in the actual business world. And you will be doing case studies, presentations, role plays, and skill-based training, etc. Seminars, conferences, guest talks are also organized, which will enable you to uh, which will enable you to become ready to go for further studies, or which will make you enable to go to industry in case you want to do after your BBA. In COVID-19, like we have, uh, there was a lot of disruption and we have we a have lot of learning from the COVID uh, disruption. And the, of course, in this situation also, I want to express that you have a bright future. The Indian economy is recovering. Like if we see, like different uh, commodities sales have improved, like automobile sales have improved, like in case of consumer durable sales have improved. And apart from this, energy consumption has improved, like GST collection has improved. All this indicates that our, in, our economy is on the right track and you have bright future. Like the youth of the country, they have a bright future, which consists of 65% of the population, but they need to be skillful. They need to be updated. And I want to assure you once again that you have a bright future. In case in your three years journey at Gita Ratan International Business School, if you're working hard on your skills and keeping yourself updated, you definitely you are going to have a bright future. I once again welcome you to Gita Ratan International Business School. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, sir. The keynote speaker, the keynote speaker for the prelude is Professor Dr. Sanjeev Mittal. Sir has a teaching experience of 29 years to postgraduate student of business management with 16 years at Institute of Management Studies and Research. MD University, Rothak. Sir has a wide experience in academic and research. Today, Sir holds a chair as Director of Academic Affairs at Guru Gobind Singh Indraprastha University. I would like to invite Professor Dr. Sanjeev Mittal to give his blessings to the students. So, good morning to all present. 
and uh, i am really thankful to geeta ratan international business school for so giving kindly you... make your video on acha okay now it is visible yeah now it is okay yeah yeah, yeah. so good morning to all present and i am uh, indeed delighted uh, to address the fresh batch of bba students who has been admitted during this academic year 2020 <clears throat> 21 and uh, <clears throat> i am grateful and thankful to the director geeta ratan international business school the vice chairman mr anirudh chandal and the chairperson of the institution and <clears throat> all my faculty colleagues at geeta ratan international business school now friends uh, uh, you are lucky to uh, take admission in the bba program of uh, guru gobind singh in the prasth university and you are also fortunate to get a very good institution which is a plus uh, ranked by the government of ncti of delhi radha rabar university and that is gita ratan international business school now uh, i will basically like to give you some important information both which are required for you as students uh, to mold your career to make your career as well as what type of uh, say things you have to observe as students once you have joined this prestigious course of bb friends this program when we say it is bachelor of business administration and it is a graduation degree will basically give you ample knowledge in terms of how to manage the business and there are three important things to manage any type of a business one is what is called as a skill set and i am also going to give you an idea what type of skills we are going to uh, shape once you are there as a bba student second thing what is required is the right type of an attitude because it is being said if the students are having right attitude then that attitude can take the students to higher altitude so how to develop that right attitude how to develop that positive attitude that i am trying to focus upon and the third thing which is very important is the knowledge and this knowledge is also very important because tomorrow if you have to take certain decisions in business for that you require some knowledge and this knowledge is going to be imparted out over here during the classrooms which you are going to attend as a part of the time table now first of all i'll start with the type of the skills which are required to become a student of uh, business management so one very important skill that is required is an analytical skill and when i say analytical i talk of critical skill so what i want to uh, emphasize about this analytical skill is that don't accept anything in its originality always try to have a inquisitive mind to always question why and when we say why this why part is nothing that we are trying to put ourselves into analysis situation and that is very very important friends so i think it has already been emphasized as a part of the pedagogy of this bba program you are going to have lot of case studies you are going to have some simulation exercises you are going to have some sort of role plays all these types of activities which are going to be there as a part of your bba program are going to help you so what uh, trying to help you in terms of uh, getting these types of analytical skills i just uh, uh, illustrate how exactly we help the student to uh, get hold of these analytical skills i give a live situation before you there is an organization which is into money lending money lending i think you must be understanding that they are trying to finance the consumer durables right so if somebody wants to buy a refrigerator or something in terms of white goods and they do not have the money so ultimately they have to get these durables financed so there is a firm which is into money lending and uh, this firm uh, is operating in one particular area and in that area they have employed different types of what we are talking in terms of sales persons now uh, they had given uh, 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 they had given these types of territories to these types of sales persons and once they had given uh, different types of territories to different types of sales persons so uh, they have been assigned two types of responsibilities one is to get to have new and new customers as a part of the customer base and secondly to whatever customers they have lended the money they have to recover the money from those types of customers now one of the sales person who has been assigned a particular territory does not go to his own area and as a result of that company is losing business and when the company is losing business automatically the business is being uh, uh, say gathered by their competitors so companies in a fix what to do with that type of a sales person 
so there are two alternatives before a company either to fire that sales person and in place of that sales person appoint another sales person or basically to basic motivate that type of a sales person mentor that sales person that why he is not performing the duties what has been assigned to him now uh, both these alternatives are open to the company but if we go for the first alternative that the com- that the company decides to fire that sales person then other sales persons uh, may also um, uh, become say angry because of this action on the part of the company and therefore they may also like to leave the company so i think this alternative of firing is not acceptable to the company because that is going to create a bad environment as a part of the overall climate of the company hence the second alternative is to mentor the sales person so they have mentored the sales person a lot they have asked the sales person what is your problem aap apni problem hame bataiye and that sales person is always saying sir main bimar rehta hu and because of that i am not in a position to come to my field so this is a very difficult situation before the company what to do now the company wants to find a solution to this type of a problem ab aisi problems bahut sari business ke andar aati hain ye to maine aapko ek bahut choti si ek problem batayi hai so what will be the solution to this particular problem to hum aap logon ko ye batayenge ki aise solutions ko arrive karne ke liye hame kya karna chahiye we should think in terms of deciding the targets to be given to the sales person and why the company should give the targets to the sales person why don't they ask the sales person to decide their own targets तो अगर कंपनी सेल्स पर्सन के ऊपर ही छोड़ देती है कि आप ही अपने टारगेट्स को फिक्स करें तो शायद ये एक डेमोक्रेटिक स्टाइल ऑफ फंक्शनिंग होगा ऑन दी पार्ट ऑफ दी मैनेजर्स ऑफ दी कंपनी और कंपनी इस डेमोक्रेटिक स्टाइल को अडॉप्ट करते हुए अपने सेल्स पर्सन को ये इन्फॉर्म करती है कि वाई डोंट यू फिक्स दी टारगेट्स तो अब हर सेल्स पर्सन अपने टारगेट्स को फिक्स करता है और वो कहता है कि जनवरी में आई एम गोइंग टू गिव यू द सेल्स ऑफ दिस मच यूनिट्स फेबररी में मैं इतने यूनिट्स की सेल दूंगा और इस तरह से टिल दिसंबर द कैलेंडर ऑफ द टारगेट्स इज मेड बाय ऑल सेल्स पर्सन जब सारे सेल्स पर्सन अपने टारगेट्स को डिसाइड करते हैं तो जो ये नॉन परफॉर्मिंग सेल्स पर्सन है ही इज ऑल्सो फोर्स टू डिसाइड दी टारगेट्स और कंपनी एक पॉलिसी बनाती है कि ये टारगेट्स मीट करने हैं और जो सेल्स पर्सन अपने टारगेट्स जनवरी में नहीं मीट कर पाएगा तो देन दे हैव टू गेट दिस टारगेट्स मेट इन दी मंथ ऑफ फेबररी बिकॉज इन दी मंथ ऑफ फेबररी वॉट एवर आर दी टारगेट्स दी टारगेट्स ऑफ जनवरी विल ऑल्सो बी एडिड एंड दिस इज हाउ एक्जैक्टली द टारगेट्स आर गोइंग टू कीप ऑन इंक्रीजिंग टिल द टाइम द सेल्स पर्सन अचीव दोज टारगेट्स सो इट इज एग्रीड बाई ऑल दी सेल्स पर्सन एंड देयर फोर ऑल दी सेल्स पर्सन गो बैक टू देर रिस्पेक्टिव फील्ड एंड स्टार्ट वर्किंग आउट ओवर देयर अब क्योंकि ये जो सेल्स पर्सन था जो परफॉर्म uh, uh, नहीं करता था देर फोर दिस सेल्स पर्सन विल नेवर बी इंटरेस्टेड टू अचीव दी टारगेट्स अब वो जनवरी के टारगेट्स जो थे ही कुड नॉट अचीव दे वर एडिड इन दी मंथ ऑफ फेबररी फेबररी के टारगेट्स प्लस जनवरी के टारगेट्स यू कुड नॉट अचीव दैट वर एडिड ओवर देर इन दी मंथ ऑफ दी मार्च और ऐसे करने से हुआ क्या टारगेट्स बिकेम सो सो हाई टारगेट्स इतने इंक्रीज uh, हो गए कि अल्टीमेटली देर वॉज लॉट ऑफ स्ट्रेस ऑन दी पार्ट ऑफ द सेल्स पर्सन and finally ultimately that sales person came back to the company and tendered his resignation to dekhiye ek choti si approach jiske andar humne sirf aap logon ko ye bataya ki why don't you think in terms of setting the targets and if these targets are not met by the sales person that is going to create a stress and the stress is going to basically motivate the sales person to tender the resignation ab isse kya hua saap bhi mar gaya aur laathi bhi nahi tooti the company is in a position to basically get rid of that particular sales person who was non performing so what i want to give you an idea is that there are a lot of skills which are required to manage the business and one such skill is analytical skill which i have just tried to illustrate with the help of a small example then another type of skill which is very very important is in terms of communication skill because friends whenever we are trying to do business we are trying to have lot of negotiation and during these negotiations the most important skill that is required is what is that of communication and it is being said in communication that either you convince me or you are convinced so we are trying to train our students in such a manner that once they have very good communication they will be in a position to have convincing talk and because of those convincing talks they will be in a position to achieve their targets and that is how exactly communication skill so i think in bba program we have uh, uh, put lot of subjects we have lot of training uh, on communication so as to improve the managerial communication of all the students who are part of this bba program the third very important skill is nothing but we are talking in terms of technical skill and this technical skill comes with the help of what the type of the specialization which you are going to do towards the end semesters of your bba program 
so we have uh, say specialization in the field of marketing we have specialization in the field of finance we have specialization in the field of human resource management then we talk in terms of uh, say the operations area now we are also going to introduce another skill set and that is in terms of business analytics so what we need to understand is that there are a lot mm-hmm. of skill sets which are required uh, on the part of these students now i think uh, more knowledge you will get about these skills which are required a uh, moment you are going to join your classes over there is a part of your uh, this institution gitaratan international business school now the second thing which i have already emphasized out over here is to develop the right attitude friends and to develop the right attitude is only possible when you are trying to keep your mind open hame ye samajhna hai ki har burai mein chupi hui hai kya achhai if we can just find out that it is not important to fail agar main kisi wajah se apni life ke andar ya kisi bhi course ke andar acha nahi kar paya to it does not mean that something bad has happened with me but i think i have to learn a lesson friends that why i am not in a position to fare well in any one of this subject and if you are in a position to introspect mm-hmm. yourself and find out what are the weaknesses which are there in you and you are trying to therefore now work on to correct your weaknesses i think that is what we are trying to talk in terms of an attitude so attitude is a way of thinking friends what is good and what is bad and what i want to emphasize out over here is that <clears throat> your day to day exposure your day to day interactions your day to day thoughts your day to day style of functioning is going to help you to develop a positive attitude aur aisa kaha jata hai friends ki ek kharab ghadi bhi agar hum dekhte hain ghadi kharab ho gayi hai to din mein do baar wo bhi sahi time batati hai and that is what is very important friends that we really have to develop that type of positive attitude even if some some faculty has basically scolded you some faculty has punished you don't feel bad friends what i want to give you an idea is that have that sportsman spirit ki unke dantne mein bhi kahin na kahin unka pyar chupa hua hai aur agar aap aisi baaton ko apne andar samaj lenge to i think you will be in a position to emerge as what as a student with a positive attitude organizations who are trying to hire the students they not only test for the knowledge of the student but they also try to test the attitude of the student ab jaise aap se ek question agar ye pucha jaye what is the color of the wall at the back where you are sitting i think to jo wall ka color back pe hoga wahi wall ka color front mein hoga so this is how exactly we really have to improve our thinking where we are always trying to see from the positivity rather than from the negativity and this is very important for what for students of uh, business administration that they require to have a positive or a right attitude and for that particular reason i think from day one you really have to struggle third thing is very important and that is what is knowledge friends i have already said this knowledge is required to take certain important decision in business in the areas of your functional specialization and from where this knowledge comes from from this knowledge comes from information and you get this information from where either you get this information from books or you get the information through classes where the faculties come and they share their information or you get this information from where from the internet now friends uh, there are different sources from where you have to gather the information the idea is that when you process that information that is converted into knowledge and this knowledge is very important to arrive at a decision i have already said now uh, professor huti who is a director he was giving you an idea that after covid indian economy is improving and i think this information that has been shared by him is a positive information that shows what the positivity with respect to what job market is going to improve the employment opportunities are going to improve and the uh, the opportunities to start one's own business is going to improve the opportunities to pursue higher studies are also going to improve so when everything is positive i think our mind also become positive so what we need to understand is that don't try to miss your classes and that is very very important advice i will like to give you because don't feel that you are not going to get anything in the classes i just want to emphasize out over here all informations that is shared in the classes have been collected from diverse sources which may not be possible for you as students to collect so therefore my advice to you is that in order to become knowledgeable attending classes is very very important classes helps us 
to develop positive attitude to gather skills as well as to gather some type of positive knowledge and that is very very important friends and uh, i will also like to emphasize being from the university and uh, director of academic affairs friend that whatever curriculum that we have made for our bba program take my words for granted that really has been made understanding the industry requirement so friends whatever courses whatever pedagogy that is going to be used to teach those courses they are going to be the best and if you want to be the best student on this particular earth take my words friend that don't try to miss the class you may have some emergencies you may have some important work but i don't feel that anything uh, is more important as compared to what to emerge as a brighter student and that is only possible by attending classes now i have already said positive attitude even if some faculty is coming and he is sharing some information which is found to be outdated but friends don't try to look from that perspective try to find out what is that type of information that has been shared which may be outdated but is really important to you in your life in order to mold you to become successful in your life life so friends i just want to give you this uh, these three important things plus i will also like to say that every student want to be successful now what is the what is the uh, uh, way that i can become successful so i put it like this that if i have a positive attitude and i combine positive attitude with hard work right then basically you can think in terms of 100% success why i am saying so because you can do it yourself practically now if there are 26 alphabets in english and we have a to z and you assign number 1 to a and assign number 26 to z make a total of this word attitude you will find the total of this word attitude will be 100 you again do the total of hard work right and this you will also see to be 100 so friends if you want to be 200% sure that you want to be successful in your life try to have 100% positive attitude and do 100% of your hard work and hard work is only in terms of three important things which i would like to emphasize first the hard work is in terms of uh, being sincere for the purpose for which you are taking up this type of course of study and your purpose is only and only to <clears throat> take up bba program to complete your graduation so that it opens gateways not only for employment not only to become entrepreneur but also to pursue higher studies so for that particular reason friends i think you really have to be sincere and devoted and dedicated student and that is the first thing and second thing in terms of hard work is in terms of what whatever assignments whatever say work has been assigned to be completed be always prepared to what take up that work take up the challenge and therefore complete that type of work and therefore try to come up to the expectations of home of your faculty and third type of hard work is that do something extra do something extra reading do some extra say courses do some extra say effort in order to complete this uh, say this program now friends uh, whatever you are getting in the classrooms don't feel that it is going to be 100% and in order to make it 100% what i will like to advise you is that do something extra and this extra is very very important for you aapne dekha hoga agar hum kabhi bhi koi saman kharidte hain aur agar koi hame kuch thoda sa bhi extra agar hame de deta hai to we are not only satisfied but we are delighted तो अगर आप भी अपनी फैकल्टी को अगर आप अपने जो टीचर्स हैं उनको डिलाइट करना चाहते हैं उनकी रिस्पेक्ट अर्न करना चाहते हैं तो डू दैट एक्स्ट्रा दिस एक्स्ट्रा इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फ्रेंड्स इन द लाइफ एंड फॉर दिस एक्स्ट्रा आई थिंक यू कैन रीड सम इंपॉर्टेंट फिक्शन इन द एरिया ऑफ मैनेजमेंट बहुत अच्छी अच्छी किताबें हमारे यहाँ मैनेजमेंट में अवेलेबल है जैसे यू कैन रीड द स्टोरी ऑफ हाउ एग्जैक्टली the tata was run by say the uh, ratan ji tata there can be autobiography of uh, azim prem ji how exactly he has uh, managed wipro there are various other types of fictions which are there so try to read these management fictions friend aur jitni zyada aap ye achhi achhi kitabon ko jo management se related hai inko padhenge that is going to open your pure mind and that is going to help you to what further take interest in this type of a discipline which is nothing but management and friends it is being said management is nothing but what manage the men tactfully 
M A N A G E is manage. M E N is what men. Men is nothing but the workforce, and yeah, T stands for what is tactfully. So management is manage men tactfully, and how it is possible, friends, by doing something extra, by doing, by reading something extra, and this extra is very important. तो आपको ये समझना होगा कि वॉट एवर थ्री ईयर्स यू आर गोइंग टू स्पेंड ट्राई टू टेक द मैक्सिमम एडवांटेज ऑफ दो थ्री ईयर्स इन टर्म्स ऑफ नॉट ओनली अटेंडिंग क्लासेस नॉट ओनली कंप्लीटिंग द असाइनमेंट विच आर गिवन टू यू नॉट ओनली कंप्लीटिंग अदर टाइप ऑफ रोल्स विच आर असाइन टू यू मे बी देर आर सम सेमिनार्स मे बी देर आर समर्कशॉप विच आर बींग ऑर्गेनाइज बाई द इंस्टीट्यूशन And friends, जितने भी ये वर्कशॉप जितने भी ये सेमिनार्स ऑर्गेनाइज हों आपको इनमें बढ़ चढ़ के पार्ट लेना है एवरी स्टूडेंट हैज टू कम फॉरवर्ड टू शो द विलिंगनेस टू डू दी वर्क फॉर दी सेमिनार्स देखिए आपको जो है नॉलेज के साथ साथ यू हैव टू इम्प्रूव योर पर्सनैलिटी यू हैव टू शार्पन योर पर्सनैलिटी और आपकी पर्सनैलिटी शार्पन तभी होगी वेन यू आर एक्टिवली इन्वॉल्व इन ऑल टाइप्स ऑफ एक्टिविटीज विच आर ऑर्गेनाइज इन द इंस्टीट्यूशन और ये कहा गया है पर्सनैलिटी का तो जो पहला कॉम्पोनेंट है दैट इज ऑलवेज द ड्रेस कोड राइट तो हमने एज आई पी यूनिवर्सिटी वी हैव नॉट डिसाइडेड एनी ड्रेस कोड फॉर एनी टाइप ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स हु टेक एडमिशन इन आई पी यूनिवर्सिटी और द एफिलियटेड इंस्टीट्यूशन बट द ड्रेस कोड मीन्स फॉर वेन एवर यू कम टू योर क्लासेज फ्रेंड वेन एवर यू इंटरेक्ट विद द फैकल्टी वेन एवर यू गो टू सम ऑर्गेनाइजेशन एज ए पार्ट ऑफ योर प्लान विजिट और एज अ पार्ट ऑफ योर ओरिएंटेशन माई रिक्वेस्ट टू ऑल दी स्टूडेंट्स हु आर ट्राइंग टू लिसन टू मी इज दैट ऑलवेज वी आर फॉर्मल ड्रेस नो फ्रेंड्स फॉर्मल ड्रेस मीन्स वॉट Now, whenever we talk in terms of shirt, there that has to be shirt of light color, and whenever we talk of trousers, I think trousers should always be of dark color. Or, कोशिश करिए schools में आपने ties पहनी हैं, तो why don't you think in terms of continuing that type of an habit and even start wearing these ties when you come over there to these colleges? क्योंकि ये कहा जाता है कि we learn good habits either from the family or from the institution. So my advice to all the students who are trying to listen to me is that never try to compromise with your dress. And if you are formally dressed, friends, take my words. You are going to look nice. Mm -hmm. Or presentation, आज के दिन बड़ी important है, friends. और आपको ये presentation सिर्फ आपको corporate life में नहीं देनी है. But you have to improve your presentation. And presentation की practice आपको कहाँ से शुरू कर देनी है? From the college where you have started, uh, say, or you have been admitted, or you are going to start attending the classes. So ये कुछ बहुत छोटी-छोटी बातें हैं, which I just thought I should share with you. और जो चीजें जो मैं आप लोगों से बात करना चाहता हूं फ्रेंड्स वो बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट है और वो मैं आपको ये बताना चाहता हूं कि इंट्रोस्पेक्शन इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर ऑल स्टूडेंट्स देखिए आप एक बहुत ही प्रेस्टिजियस कोर्स में आए हैं विच इज नेम्ड एज बैचलर ऑफ बिजनेस एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन जिसका जो एक अपवर्ड कोर्स है दैट इज मास्टर्स ऑफ बिजनेस एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन सो बैचलर इज अ फाउंडेशन कोर्स and if your foundations are good friends i think it will be easy for you to what master the master course and for that particular reason friend sincerity is very very important to ye ek word hai sincerity jisko aapko true sense mein aapko samajhna hoga sincerity means what you really have to be uh, timely right you have to understand the importance of time aur aisa kaha gaya hai ki indians are worst people in terms of time management और आपने देखा होगा अब इंडिया के अंदर देर आर मेनी कंपनीज हु हैव कम फ्रॉम जापान आई विल लाइक टू गिव यू एन एग्जांपल दैट वी हैव अ प्लेस कॉल्ड इज नीम राना व्हिच इज अ इंडस्ट्रियल एरिया इन राजस्थान एंड दिस नीम राना इज अ प्लेस इन राजस्थान हैज बीन गिवन फॉर द एस्टेब्लिशमेंट ऑफ ऑल टाइप्स ऑफ इंडस्ट्रीज फ्रॉम जापान एंड देर आर मोर देन टू फिफ्टी इंडस्ट्रीज हु हैव कम ओपर ओवर देयर इन नीम राना and whenever they are hiring people from india the first type of training they give to indian people is that of time management so you can understand that how indians are casual towards time and the students you also have to understand the importance of time if the classes have to start at 9 i think you have to be there in the institution by 8:45 right why you are trying to take a chance to basically reach the institution on time aur agar kahin raaste mein aapko jam mil gaya ya koi bhi agar aapke sath <coughs> कोई भी कंटीजेंसी होगी तो यू विल बी लेट सो टाइम को आपको समझना है सो व्हाट आई वांट टू से इज दैट आइदर यू ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट दी टाइम मैनेजमेंट इज फ्रॉम द जैपनीज पर्सपेक्टिव और ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड द इंपॉर्टेंस ऑफ टाइम फ्रॉम द मिलिट्री पर्सपेक्टिव अगर आप मिलिट्री के जवान से अगर आप बात करेंगे तो वो सोल्जर भी आपको बताएगा कि हमारे यहाँ सात बजे का मतलब है पौने सात बजे वी हैव टू रिपोर्ट ओवर देयर टू आर ऑफिसर सो दिस इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एंड इंडियंस बेसिकली टेक वेरी वेरी कैजुअल अप्रोच टूवर्ड्स दी टाइम 
और अगर हम बात करते हैं तो ऐसा कहा जाता है हमारे इंडिया के बारे में कि इंडियंस दे बिलीव इन व्हाट इज कॉल्ड एज आईएसटी जबकि वो इंटरनेशनल स्टैंडर्ड टाइम है बट इंडिया में आईएसटी को कहा जाता है इंडियन स्ट्रेचेबल टाइम तो आपको टाइम को स्ट्रेच नहीं करना बहुत लोगों को मैंने देखा है जब वो बिजनेस कर रहे होते हैं एंड दे आर मीटिंग देयर कस्टमर्स और दे आर मीटिंग देयर सप्लायर्स और यार मैं जल्दी आ गया वो की फर्क पैंता है यार so this kfp policy should not be practiced and as students of business administration friends i think you really have to polish yourself you really have to be disciplined you have to understand the importance of your purpose you have to be sincere you have to be devoted you have to be dedicated friends you are different from b b is bachelor of arts but you are not bachelor of arts you are students of what business administration and therefore although b a is also bachelor of arts same as ba over here ba does not mean bachelor it means what it is basically business administration to agar aap graduation business administration mein kar rahe hain we have to understand the importance of all these words there <coughs> in business business mein maine aapko bataya personality ki badi importance hai communication ki badi importance hai discipline ki badi importance hai time management ki badi importance hai फ्रेंड्स इससे जो आगे जो बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट है एंड दैट इज टू बी प्रोएक्टिव हमें बिजनेस में अगर आगे निकलना है तो वी हैव नॉट टू बी रिएक्टिव वी हैव टू बी प्रोएक्टिव और उस प्रोएक्टिविटी के लिए हमें कुछ एक्स्ट्रा करना होगा वी हैव टू डू सम एक्स्ट्रा स्टडी वी हैव टू टेक सम एक्स्ट्रा वेल्यूडिशन कोर्सेज वी हैव टू डू सम एक्स्ट्रा रीडिंग फ्रेंड्स और आई थिंक इसके लिए You have joined a good institution which is Kedaratan International Business School, which has a very good library. I would like to advise all the students who are trying to listen to me try to visit this library on a regular basis. If you have any class that is empty, always take opportunity to visit the library. And don't read the textbooks. My advice to you is read the management sections, read the magazines which are there. Read the textbooks. My advice to you is read the management sections, read the magazines which are there. Read the textbooks. My advice to you is read the management sections, read the magazines which are there. Right, we have business today. We have India today, and उससे पहले हमारे यहाँ कुछ business newspapers भी आते हैं. And one such business newspaper is Economic Times. अभी से habit डालिए friends to understand and read these types of important magazines and newspapers which are related to our business. And there will be lot of terms I think which are not going to be understand by you. And therefore, friends, try to get the explanation of these terms from the faculty whenever you are there in the classes. देखिए you have to become a challenge to your faculty and faculty should not be feared friends rather faculty should fear you and how the faculties will fear you when you are prepared and you come prepared in the classes you do advanced reading you do lot of study you read lot about what indian economy you read lot about what is the environment that surrounds the indian business you read lot about what is happening in the world in terms of our business sphere aur jitna zyada aap अपने आप को एब्रेस रखेंगे अपडेटेड रखेंगे आई थिंक दैट इज व्हाट इज रिक्वायर्ड एज स्टूडेंट ऑफ अवर बिजनेस एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन सो मैंने कहा आपको प्रोएक्टिव बनना है यू हैव नॉट टू बी रिएक्टिव आज क्लास नहीं हुई तो आई थिंक हमारे लिए दिवाली है आज हमारे लिए होली है फॉर गेट अबाउट दीज थिंग्स में इफ टीचर इज नॉट द क्लास इज नॉट देयर आई थिंक देयर इज अ लाइब्रेरी देयर देयर इज व्हाट स्टूडेंट्स यू कैन फॉर्म सर्टेन ग्रुप्स यू कैन फॉर्म सर्टेन सोसाइटीज एंड of these societies try to read a lot friends try to interact a lot try to do as much as you can friends and if you are in a position to do these things take my words for granted you will emerge as a winner i keep on hearing lot of people and they say that we are lucky to be a part of iims indian institute of management or we are lucky to be a part of good institution take my words for granted friends institutions are made good by the students institutes are not good without the students friends So, if you also want to make Gitaratan International Business School as a good institution, I think first of all you have to be good. And for that particular reason, I had given you lot of tips, friend, how you can become good. Try to understand the meaning of this word student, friend. And if I say student, S stands for what is called as skill sets. I have already said lot of skill sets you have to have. When I say the next letter, that is T. T stands for what you have to be tactful. because management is nothing but what handling of the man handling of the resources and that to tactfully and for that particular reason i have already said you really have to be tactful and these tacts you are going to learn through lot of these case studies and through lot of these simulation and through lot of what role plays which you are going to have when you talk in terms of you as a part of the student it is nothing but called as untiring curiosity you have to be curious you should learn a lot friend you have to understand how exactly reliance is increasing by leaps and 
found how in a position reliance is doing so well how reliance is diversifying and if you are going to read these types of case studies of your own friends don't expect that these case studies are going to be taught in the classes and moment you have this untiring curiosity friends take my word for granted you are definitely going to become very good student and when we talk in terms of d d stands for what devotion d stands for dedication friend you really have to be devoted you have to be dedicated as a student to be regular in terms of classes trying to understand the importance of time and all these things are very very important many students they come to me and they say whether we are going to get the employment after doing this type of a graduation degree i normally ask the students employment is not difficult provided you are employable so in order to become employable friends you have to have those skill sets aap se industries wale puchte hain do you know how to work on excel aap ne kaha sir mujhe thoda bahut to aata hai why this thoda bahut i think if you would have done something extra you should have taken a short term course on excel i think you could have polish your skills so that is very important friends so before you desire you try to deserve and for that deserving i think if you deserve nobody on this earth can stop you from becoming employable and for that particular reason i have already said you have to be de devoted you really have to be dedicated when we talk in terms of e e stands for do something extra extra in terms of participate in extra curricular activities participate in seminars participate in workshops participate in what any type of inter college inter university programs are there go and participate in that any type of quiz programs are there participate do something extra friends not only not only come to the institute only and only for studies do something extra you as students are meant for doing extra you have energies friend channelize these energies e also stands for energy and moment you channelize your energies i think you will be in a position to do that extra when you talk in terms of n n means what never have no on your say uh, on your face never say no to anything friends right you always should be yes men you should always see positivity rather than negative so avoid negativity as a student friends right you really have normal in your behavior always yes men and that is very very important i think ye jo sab main baatein bata raha hu dheere dheere aapko lag raha hoga these are difficult but these are not difficult these are going to be very easy for those students who are always receptive to whatever information is shared with them and finally when we talk in terms of t and this t is nothing i have already said for all these things you require lot of training friends classrooms are part of training you will be assigned some type of summer project that is a part of training you will be asked to write some assignment that will also a part of training you will be asked to make some presentation on certain topic that is also a part of training so don't avoid these trainings right any type of guest lectures are there in the institution are yaar aaj to guest lecture hai aaj to class nahi hogi chalo diwali manate hain chalo picnic manate hain sorry friends as students now you have not come over here for doing picnics you have not come out over here to celebrate these festivals you have come out over here to do lot of learning friends and learning can only come when you are sincere towards your purpose and these training programs that are organized by the institution besides classrooms are a part of what giving you those extras and these extras will always help you to become what successful in your life now friends i think i have lot many things to say but i will not put lot of stress on you main aap logon ko zyada darane ki koshish nahi karunga but i would like to say that don't forget that god is great to you that you are in a position to take admission in the bba program and that to over there at a good institution of our university that is gidaratan international business school enjoy every second of your life friends but this enjoyment has to be in terms of learning this enjoyment has to be in terms of what knowledge sharing and knowledge gathering this enjoyment has to be in terms of doing something extra this enjoyment has to be in terms of what giving you your best to the institution and best to the course which you have joined right so i think uh, i have taken a lot of your time but uh, uh, i hope that your stay is going to be uh, comfortable you will love this institution you will love this program and i assure you as director of academic affairs of guru gobind singh indrapas university that we are making all types of efforts to keep on revising this program and trying to basically look towards what that whatever courses we are trying to have whatever programs whatever scheme and curriculum that we are trying to have is the best as compared to the other institutions
institutions of the uh, of not only india but we are also trying to benchmark them with that of the world and for that particular reason friends uh, always thank god always thank your parents that uh, they mm-hmm. had basically made effort for you in order to join such a prestigious program of this uh, university and that to a prestigious institution of our university so with these words i uh, give full stop to my communication but i hope that whatever i have said that has to be made practical by you thank you very much from my side friends thank you sir for your kind words now i would like to invite our academic coordinator professor dr anup kosh to address the students good morning my dear students first of all i must uh, say thanks to professor sanjeev mittal sir to give us a very lucid idea about what the course is how it is being run what actually we are asking from our students the students who has joined just after completing his uh, i say journey in the schools and higher schools after that when they have joined the course like dba uh, so obviously they have a mindset to become a business manager or an entrepreneur so with this journey if they can make themselves properly developed ultimately they should be have a good idea that how they can make a good profession chicago phone kar raha hai let me uh, start with a idea about okay yes yes obviously sir has said it's a is required so with this uh, let me check and let me show you what you have to follow what we can provide and how best you can hone your knowledge and skill in this 3 years journey in kitaratan international business school so my dear students uh, let me show you a simple slide where the institute gitaratan international business school is a well established since 2004 it is affiliated to guru gobind singh hindustan university you already have learned and it is approved by university grant commission ministry of hrd government of india the national assessment and accreditation council which is known as nac who used to accredited the whole country's institutes they have accredited our institute as category a not only for the first time but in its second cycle we have awarded category a plus that is the highest rating by the joint assessment committee of the delhi government as well as ip university since 2013 that is the long 8 years we are continuously in the highest rating we got the category a it is also the highest rating by quality audit cell of gdsip university since 2011 we are iso 9001 2015 certified institute basically uh, our achievements is all over the india we have identified as number 93 as per dalal street investment journal 2007 we have ranked number 2 by times b school survey 2018 as well as 2019 now the whole activity of this institute are the brain child of some i say lot many academicians educationist as well as the industrial people like professor mohammad akbar professor jail gupta professor harsh bharma professor r k singh professor sudhir jain prof dr s p sharma professor v bhattacharya dr gulshan rai dr devi singh dr irfan rizvi professor c k jaggi professor r k mittal professor hoti all the renowned educationist and professors used to come together as our advisory body of gifts who 
frame on who under whose strategic guidance this institute is running its curriculum as well as pedagogy now the vision without vision a institute cannot develop and they cannot portray anything before their stakeholders so the vision of this institute is to prepare outstanding professional in business management and law discipline who can provide intellectual emotional psychological relation leadership design develop implement system and processes and research innovate compete at national and international level that means we want to develop our students from all the arena so that they can face their future days as a leader and they can compete successfully in their business domain the mission of the institute is to provide integrated learning experience stressing basic skill development academic excellence employable skill preparation and intellectual rigor we also want to promote integrated personality development of the students encourage research and excellence in all activities of teaching fraternity we promote continuous improvement in processes and systems through innovative ideas and technologies and nurture culture of fairness equity and partnership uh in gita ratan there are basically different courses we are providing uh, like master of business administration mba international business bba llb integrated bllb integrated as well as the bba course you have joined the rohini educational society has different uh, i say educational institutes uh, gita ratan international business school uh, where we you were there there is also bitaratan institute of advanced studies and training where bed med ett ecc courses are being trained bitaratan general public school which is also in rohini sector 7 bitaratan general kidi paradise it is also in rohini itself the sovereign a senior secondary school so a lot many uh, educational school experience has had with this uh, i say rohini educational society and they are successfully running their a uh, domain a uh, very uh, well disciplined manner if you see the organizational structure because you should have a uh, good knowledge about this one that is the organizational structure at the helm uh, there is chairman then vice chairman and under uh, beneath them there is a management committee which already i have explained uh, under them there is the academic uh, i say head that is director you already uh, met him Uh, below to them there is academic coordinator under them program coordinators of different program then program coordinator uh, other than this there is system administration training and placement officer library admin officer and in this way at the last there are students who will usually get the whole structure from above to bottom already you have uh, met with our director sir professor b s hoti he is a doctorate in management from jamia millia islamia new delhi and he is also an alumni of i am calcutta has a vast experience of over 30 years in both academics as well as in industry he has authored several research papers for national and international publication and he has also authored a book on strategy our academic coordinators and program coordinators for bba program is myself professor anup ghosh i am the academic coordinator for ug program professor uma gulati she is the academic coordinator for pg programs dr pooja sri sharma she is the program coordinator of bb uh in gita ratan international business school the number of faculty members is a very big one there is all together 72 faculty members out of which 10 professors 15 associate professor and 47 assistant professors uh, many of them are doctorate and well learned well versed well experienced a few maybe do not have uh, their uh, i say doctorate but they are in the process of completion of their doctorate very soon so we have that richness in our pedagogical development by the teaching group and the faculty members other than this 
as per the requirement of ministry of hrd every uh, i say organization need some flavor mm-hmm. of industry so that is why there is a regular i say connectivity with the guest faculty at gives uh, you can see a uh, rich lot the ms pallavi prakash she is the founder and ceo of knowledge seed learning dr runa maitro she is the uh, pupil talent international partner director dr felton link uh, chief human capital officer dr ak jain president jk sugar ms madhu sharma dr subhas kakkar ms navin kumar vk gupta karuna ahuja dr shankar goenka all of them used to come at a different point of time to meet with you and to deliver different types of uh, i say lectures your skill development your personality development in different way they will meet uh, in this a uh, three year four coming three years journey uh, yes there is also the name is not very small dr kk goel arun rawal garima misra mr am ramachandran rita gangwani pooja dudani pranav kullar estus di suja dr yasho vivarma so everybody uh, they are very keen to come to uh, gitaratan international business school where they are uh, i say loved to come in this institute and to teach the students off and on now uh, coming to the next part while you were uh, taking a course obviously you should know what is the marks pattern there are each and every semester as it is a semester based course so in each and every semester you have five to six subjects and in each subjects there are two components of marks out of total 100 marks you have to face 70 marks in your term end examination which is taken by university that is gds ipo but the 25 marks this is your internal evaluation which is a continuous evaluation process uh, most of our students are very much regular in their attendance they are uh, taking part in the different examination because they want the full 25 marks and i i can assure you that if you are honest you will get every subject this internal 25 marks itself because you have earned it no one will give you as a gatis that let uh, you should take it is my gatis you will learn you will whenever you will attend the classes you automatically will get the 100% marks in attendance that is 10 out of 10 uh, in the class test two uh, it is a pen and paper mode long answer type and class test one it is online mcq based uh, though the marking pattern is 5 10 but the examination used to take for class test one it is of 30 marks and class test two it is of 75 marks uh, which will ultimately convert pro rata basis into 5 10 and attendance is 5 so this is the internal mark system as per university guidelines whenever you will grade uh, a marks in the university examination out of 100 the marks often will converted into a letter grade and there is a numerical grade point so what is that conversion rate if you get an any subject 90 to 100 your letter grade is o and numerical grade point is 10 similarly 75 to 89 it is a plus 65 to 74 a in this way if it is less than 40 or absent it will be marked as a and numerical grade point is 0 so when you will get your university score card it will be in letter grade and you can convert it into the numerical grade point uh, based upon which your sgpa and cgpa will be calculated so sgpa is the semester grade point average that is performance in a semester will be expressed as a semester grade point average that is we sum up all the uh, subjects uh, that grade point then divide it by the number of subjects and you will get the sgpa similarly cumulative grade point average is the cumulative performance of all the semester together 
that means from first to six all the semester will ultimately comes under a reflection on your cgpa about the division from final grading how university will give you the division if your CGPA is 10 out of 10, then it will be treated as excellent. If your CGPA is 6.5 or above, but below 10, then it is first division. If CGPA is between 5 to 6.49, you will get second division. And if CGPA is between 4 to 4.99, it is of third division. Uh, now students, I also inform you that for any uh, IC section that is BBA first shift, whoever be, uh, I say whoever be the student who will receive the highest marks out of that batch, he or she will be awarded as the best student and will get a cash prize of 5000 for each semester. So you have a scope to earn some excellent credit if you got the high score in your sessional batch that is uh, in first semester uh, first shift there is one and in second shift also there is one recipient in each and every semester promotion system as per the university norms minimum pass percentage in each paper is 40 percent uh, which means the total semester end and continuous evaluation paper, if we add it up and if you got 40% or more marks, you are pass. And how you will get promoted into the next year, that is every semester, uh, every year there are two semesters, that is odd and even. While combining this odd and even, and if you pass in 50% of the total papers, suppose first semester and second semester, if we combine both these two, so there is total 12 papers. Out of these 12, you, if you clear six papers, then you will automatically promote it to the second year. If not, you again have to clear and you have to earn more than six papers in the first year to get promoted into the second year. Maximum duration to complete the program is N plus two years. For yours, N means three, that is five years. N plus two means five years. So you will be given a chance up to five years to complete your course in any way if there is. Hopefully our students never have faced this type of issues. Uh, but yes, sometimes now uh, the corona or COVID cases, Suppose a student could not appear in the examination. So how many times he or she will get the chances? It is uh, after the final year, there is two more chances. And then uh, reappear in failed papers is permitted that if in your first uh, semester, you could not pass in one paper, you will have four more chances. That is in third semester, you can get the chance. In fifth semester, you will get the chance and after Completion also for another two years along with the odd semesters, you will get the odd semester back papers and with even semester, you will got the even semester back papers chances. Uh, Mittal sir has informed you that uh, be friends, uh, you must uh, devote your time uh, in different activities to develop yourself. Students, we are providing all the opportunities to create yourself a better. Uh, you just see, uh, Jinal today has started the program. She is actually uh, our student. And uh, her communication has so improved that we have asked her, please join and uh, be the anchor of this program. So there are different types of opportunity we provide to our students to hone their skill. Here, if you see, uh, you will get the add-on module on personality development. There are different add-on certificate course for your skill. Because nowadays, uh, employability is a million dollar question. Different, uh, I say, industry says that the students who are coming out from any uh, institute, they do not have skill. 
they only have a paper that is knowledge paper but don't have any skill and without skill i cannot take any person to become a responsible leader so that is why in this uh, bba course you will get free skill based training opportunity your first semester it is speaking effectively without a good spokesperson you can never put yourself as a successful manager in the second semester it is on effective writing it is also needed for every manager in the third semester it is your option there are three opportunities either you can opt from marketing side you can opt from business accounts that is fundamental of business and accounting for manager and if if you are opting for human resource so principle of human resource management out of these three certificates any one you can opt and any joining of any one is mandatory then in the fourth semester you can get retail management fundamentals of fundamental of banking and insurance business planning and project management out of these three also you have a opportunity to take any one option and in the fifth semester it is for everyone to learn tally and be a skillful person along with your knowledge your skill will automatically being developed while you will attend this certificate course uh for the students there are regular seminar uh, to learn on industry analysis there are uh, alumni lecture series where your seniors used to come and give you the idea that what problem they have faced in their own life and how they have coped it up so you will get a uh, i say idea from horse's mouth that how you can develop yourself Yes, obviously there are group discussion, assignments, case studies, case analysis, uh, and so forth, so on. There are different personality development workshop where trainers used to come from industry and train you specifically on different personality development areas. There are seminars, conferences, guest lectures on a regular basis, workshop on entrepreneurship development. There is national business pen co competition. and as well as national business quiz competition these are all co curricular activities now uh, if you feel that uh, sir in uh, geeta ratan there is no other thing other than this learning 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 education reading and something no there are also your life enjoyment too uh, this is the extra curricular activities uh, that regularly we used to uh, carry out like prelude the orientation program today you are getting into it uh, even if uh, today you are in your house if it is possible that you are in the campus so you can uh, join with different cultural activities of your seniors uh, of different clubs who will perform during uh, prelude uh, then uh, obviously we are thinking for abhinandan freshers party uh, till government is not allowing us for a party as soon as government will allow us we will organize this in every semester there must be a party uh, and in the freshers party all the students used to join enjoy the party it will used to conduct in a good banquet hall periodic in house cultural days there is cultural day 1 cultural day 2 3 2 and 3 where uh, different clubs used to conduct those uh, cultural days competitions and the best uh, team who are coming out from this in house cultural days they will take part in the external events uh, for different uh, organized by different other colleges uh, we have inter college cultural and management fest jenith uh, which is a i say good extravaganza of uh, i sell for two days it is a total fun and fun and then there is carrom and chess championship table tennis tournament badminton tournament cricket tournament avid bhakti that is farewell party students felicitation day in this day a student all the students used to be given their uh, recognition uh, about the different co curricular activities extra curricular activities as well as academic activities uh, they have honed and they have shown their Uh, i say set of uh, activities at the top 
participation in activities in other institution our uh, students have gone to different institution and bring the laurel for the institute uh, we have different clubs and societies like mudra club for music uh, singing dance avinay club drama role plays etc laksha club for sports heritage club in collaboration with speak make for cultural activities and nss and other social creative activities uh gitaratan used to provide you a ample opportunity if you uh, have a research acumen you can get the chances gitaratan has its own uh, journal uh, which is uh, international level journal all have issn number and it is uh, well recognized like journal of global information and business strategy a peer review referred yearly journal of management anushandan a research repository of gives uh, gives digest an annual magazine of gitaratan international business school delhi anubhuti that is the gives newsletter if you can see uh, uh, the book is like this one every year uh, you will get this type of a book where all the activities which have been taken place whole throughout the day uh, you can see uh, the it is printed out through a book format and you can see the participation of the students are being showcased through this book uh, similarly gives law journal it is a double blind peer reviewed yearly journal of law so students you have ample opportunity to develop your cv from the very first day if you were interested this is the student magazine uh, which uh, you can get uh, the chance to showcase your uh, quality in writing in different arena uh, it is a open forum for all the students uh, even if you can take a interview of a business person or a good business leader that will be showcased under your name also we have a rich alumni association uh, since 2004 our batches are passing out so for the last 15 years the batches are coming out and uh, you can think about the students who have passed uh, in i say 15 years ago now he or she is in the position of regional manager or zonal manager level so institute have this active alumni association uh, they are their activities are notified through institute website you all are the member of alumni association and you will get the help of your uh, seniors super seniors through this gifts alumni and they used to come to the college regularly uh, mingle with the current students uh, they have now uh, in top position like different psus mncs private limited companies and they extensively help you in placement as well as your internship activities Kitaratan has different laurels uh, in the IP University. Uh, we already have nine gold medalists from the gifts since uh, 2013, 15, 14, 16. If you can see, each and every year we have gold medalists. And for the student support system, we have student information manual. Uh, basically, this is the student information manual. Uh, you can get a copy free of it uh, whenever you will come down to college it is ready whenever you will uh, come down to college take a copy because here each and every norms are written in a very clear manner so that you can get a guidelines about the rules regulations disciplines procedures uh, etc uh, i think uh, by this time you already have uh, understood that there is a boom bank facility you will get every uh, book of every semester from the very first day as the covid pandemic is now going on uh, the students who could not come down to college for them we are providing it through uh, i say internet uh, in a, it's the digital copy but your setup copy is ready uh, we will issue a notice as soon as uh, we will get your enrollment number from university and you will come down at any day and collect your books it is for you for the whole semester then there is student feedback system regularly you have been asked to provide your feedback about the 
uh, different improvements, different problem you have faced, where we can develop through this feedback system. Yes, obviously there is a mentor uh, system uh, that is your class coordinator and your program coordinator. You will get that mentorship from them to develop yourself. Yes, uh, there is a class representative from every class. There are two representation uh, who will represent the class for every semester. There is anti-ragging committee, grievance redressal mechanism, prevention of sexual harassment, that is omen grievance redressal mechanism. Everything is in line, but uh, I can say that Gitaratan is a ragging free institute here for the last 20 years, uh, sorry, last 16 years, there is no case of ragging. Our students are so, uh, I say, humble, so disciplined that they never give us any scope of any ragging at any point of time. And uh, there is not a single case, I say, registered under the score of ragging. I think you will also maintain uh, this, uh, uh, I say, strategy which is we are following. Yes, obviously our infrastructure is, we can say world class. All the classroom are air conditioned with ICT enabled all the uh, ICT systems. Uh, there is an air conditioned auditorium of 350 seat capacity, conference hall for roundtable online meetings and webinars, seminar hall for PD workshop, activity room for group preparation and yoga, medical room equipped with all medical facilities, uh, there is centralized uh, RO plant of, of 500 TPA capacity. The whole building are provided with uh, the RO water. Uh, and if you can see that uh, fountain type uh, system are uh, fixed at every floor, where from you will get the RO water, safe drinking water. There is anti-COVID tunnel at entrance, hand sanitization machines at all corners so that uh, we can provide you the best COVID free environment inside the institute. There is cafeteria and cafe coffee day corner, separate boys and girls common room. I think you will love it very much. There is given redressal committee and its mechanism according to university norms as well as UGC guideline. Uh, the college do have its given redressal committee where there are student representatives also. Uh, yes, obviously myself is the coordinator. So if anything you can face, you can inform me also and all the other members. Uh, there is ERP system through which you can put your grievance. There is online form available at website. There also you can put your grievance if you are facing anything. On the other hand, if, when you are inside the campus in the offline mode, there is form available in the admin section first floor through which you can uh, submit your grievance and we are maintaining our two days time to sort out your grievance, whatever it is. Now learning facility, yes, library is uh, opened at 8.30 and it is open till uh, 5.30 p.m. There is odd 45,000 books altogether 79 national and international journals. There are almost 20 magazines, seven newspapers, different types of reports, which is available at our library. So opportunity are there. You can go and hone it. It is your arena. You should learn as much you can possible. Yes, sir. Uh, Mithal sir has already informed you uh, to learn uh, to read some novels, read some fictions, marriage and fictions. Yes, there is a rich fiction section also. And we are also providing uh, the digital fiction section also, which you can read from your home too. Uh, there are reading rooms uh, other than library. Inside the library, there is room number 111, 112, where there are 300 sitting capacity where students used to develop or learn uh, or read their books on the campus. In the computing facility, we have 4,000 square feet computer center with 300 mega MBPS internet connectivity, uh, having 136 nodes. 
whatever you do require you can do it while you are coming to computer center follow the norms and utilize as best as you can possible there are four separate dedicated computer labs with 60 uh, computers each uh, this is meant for teaching and research there is a specific language lab with software from oriel technology to develop your communication now uh, conduct of class students uh, very first i know that already in this semester it is late you are uh, which classes are to be joined in the month of august but due to this pandemic ultimately your uh, i say you have come to december where usually the course of uh, this semester course it used to be stopped but you are starting there so to give you the basic idea because we, i know that you are coming from different background and you also have fear on certain subjects particularly i know that the students have a fear on mathematics and accountancy so every year uh, we learn this thing from the students uh, feedback system so that is why we are starting a bridge course from 15th that is tomorrow to 24th every day from 11 am to 1 pm on this webinar jam platform we are conducting bridge course where you, your basic idea will be developed through this course uh we will provide you link today every day with the same link you will join and you attend this bridge course to make yourself par as soon as your classes will be started from 28th of december from 28th of december there will be regular class on microsoft team platform which is one of the securest platform in this world so we have in collaboration with microsoft develop this platform where you will get a individual institution email id there will be separate user id and password for every students they will uh, i say manage their own user id password by their own and they will join only through this id no external candidates or no other ids will be allowed to enter into these classes uh, in the first semester we will run this online uh, because still uh, it will run in online mode so this online courses will be run from 9 am to 1 pm on that virtual platform and we will share you the timetable very soon as soon as you get your email id on microsoft team basically the class timing for bba first shift is 8 am to 12 noon and class timing for bba second shift is 10 am to 2 pm when there will be offline mode classes but now it will run from 9 am to 1 pm for all both the first shift and second shift all the classes will run in this semester in the online mode from 9 am to 1 pm for these classes you have to join according to the timetable and the link provided by concerned faculty members every day uh, we will give you some basic training and with that it will be very easy that you have a calendar you just click on the calendar there will be a joining button and you will enter into your class there will be no uh, i say other things you have to do for this we used to disseminate our information through different way because communication and dissemination of information is one of the crux for any institute so as a good institute we provide notice board there is class coordinator who used to inform you sometimes over phone through messages uh, through whatsapp somewhere then there is program coordinator who is also connected with you you will uh, visit the college website regularly to get regular information there are ms team admin e notice board section erp based information system sms circulation system email circulation system for that to that there are different social networking site also that details i will provide you afterwards we have the industry institute partnership cell basically this resourceful student centric cell uh, it brings corporate leaders into uh, a platform where students can mingle with them 
and they can expose to those multiple opportunity for the professional world. Basically, IIPC provides you pre-placement talks, guest speaker from industry, industrial visits, summer internship fair, summer training or industrial internship, as well as placement assistance. In this team IIPC, there is Mr. Devinder Kumar, Mr. Bijay Biswas, Ms. Neha Gupta and Ms. Anjali Mittal. All are very uh, professionally developed uh, person, expert uh, from industries and they will provide you support on these IIPC works. These are the students who have, uh, though they are from MBA group because our first batch of BBA is yet to pass in this year. Uh, so. These are the students who are placed in a very high level package uh, like Zaro Education, their package is 12 lakhs per annum, Baiju's, uh, their package is also 8 to 9 lakhs, KPMG, uh, Paytm, Amazon, you know all these names. Uh, there are certain other names like Bata, uh, HDFC Bank, WNS, uh, Lenskart. So all the renowned, uh, I say, organizations used to visit but mind it students it is not a matter of institute it is a matter of candidate because organization used to come to campus to take some good prepared uh, i say employee they do not believe that your student is still kid they do not know anything and they will join after they will learn they used to come to take some people, some person who is ready in all concern. So that from the next day after joining, he or she take the leadership at their organization. So that is why your development should be highly required. If you develop yourself, there is no limit. There are organizations who used to come or maybe through, uh, I say, offline campus mode. But if you develop yourself, you can get an opportunity. Uh, we have uh, our associations and knowledge partner like Amazon Web Service, Oracle, ICT Academy, Microsoft Campus Agreement, IMA, Delnet, Oriel Technology. They provide you different type of support. And uh, maybe you will get some support from tomorrow itself uh, from different such uh, knowledge partners. We will inform you from time to time. Uh, these are the Facebook and Instagram, uh, I say, accounts of Gitaratan. Uh, you please note this. Uh, the account is uh, very simple, gives.gitaratan in both the cases. And you follow this one. For any type of, uh, I say, activities which are taking place in the org institute, you will get the information there. For any further query, you should contact Dr. Pooja Chi Sharma your program coordinator whose mail id is puja.chaturvedi at the red gitaratan.edu.in you please note this one because she is now your single point connectivity whatever problem you will face you should connect to your program coordinator she will take your problem up to the management and sort it out so with these uh, students, uh, I feel I have completed uh, what I want to inform you. I uh, always say, be active. As Mittal sir has already informed, yes, obviously you will develop yourself. These three years journey is very crucial for your life to become a, I say, wholesale manager. For that, enjoy but along with discipline and knowledge development thank you very much thank you thank you sir now let's see the students life at gibbs with the small video clip
This video really took me back to the good old days. Now, I would like to invite Dr. Pooja Chaturvedi Sharma, Program Coordinator, BBA, for word of thanks. A graceful and warm afternoon to Honorable Vice Chairman Sir, Respected Director Sir, our most valued keynote speaker, Professor Dr. Sanjeev Mittal, our academic coordinator, Professor A.K. Ghosh, and most beloved students. It's my privilege to have been asked to propose a vote of thanks on this occasion. I, Dr. Pooja Chaturvedi Sharma, on behalf of Gita Ratan International Business School and the entire college fraternity, extend a very hearty vote of thanks to the keynote speaker who spared time from his busy schedule to grace the occasion, I thank Director Sir and our academic coordinator for gracing this occasion with the valuable and informational inputs. Further, a big thank you to Master of the Ceremony, Ms. Jeanal Chaudhary, for her efforts towards anchoring of the day during this pandemic scenario. I mention my deepest sense of appreciation and would place on record my hearty thanks to all the staff members because whom we could make this event possible. So, to all the newest members of Gita Ratan International Business School family, we all welcome you and wish you a life enriching experience during your stay at Gibbs. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you all for attending the orientation program. All the very best to all the students. I hope you all have a wonderful time. Thank you. It's a